Happy Face Palm Friday. It's not at all Friday. Not not any, not even a little bit Friday. Happy Rob can't get his shit together Sunday, everybody. I know it seems kind of weird. We're doing this from my my more rantish, opinionated videos, like sitting. But um, I just wanted to make this a lot easier this week, so I could definitely get something out for you, and we can go through some shit. Um, I just recently filmed actually an opinionated video on um, other kin, uh, so you should probably go check that out. Here's a, here's a little clip from that. But if we're going to examine the true extent of the absurdity, we must venture to another place. Let's take a trip to Tumblr Town. So yeah, there's a link in the description below so you can check that out, and probably at the end of this video too, so no pressure, but check it out or I'll fucking kill you. So let's begin. You ever been to the supermarket and all of a sudden you see the total and it's like, no, that that's just slightly off. I, I don't think I'm supposed to be paying that much. Well, it really happened to this motherfucker. I was at the supermarket buying stuff and I paid for it and the cashier said the would be $56,000 and I saw a computer for the money and it was actually $1,000. Why are you buying $1,000 worth of shit at the supermarket? What's wrong with you? I said that's a lot. The said cash. <laughs> Why would they? The said. Fuck you. Ooh. I said that's a lot. The said cashier. Shut the fuck up and give me the money. But manager was there, and he said you're fired. And he gave fifty-five thousand dollars. I a free five hundred dollars. I'm not sure what the hell happened here, but I think. I think you're stupid. I think you're stupid. I think if you're walking into a supermarket, did that manager hand you 55 fucking thousand dollars? Because that's like 55 trips to the supermarket for you. So that's cool. I don't even know what happened here. I'm filming this during the day. I'm not normally active in... Next one. All right, we've all been to school pretty much, unless you're living in some place where they don't have school in which you're probably not watching me, so there you go. But everyone knows the teacher stance, that disturbing lean on your desk and just split my legs apart as far as I can teacher stance. So they're looking at someone's work like, oh, okay, well that that's wrong, that's wrong. The answer is 69. So we we got a we got we got some student who figures out a way to deal with that. Next time my teacher pulls some shit like this, I'ma eat his ass to teach him a lesson. That that is not that is a that ass is that's, that's fucking wrong. Listen, when you're going out, you gotta be real careful who you're buying shit from. I'm telling you. Craigslist and shit, that's scary fucking crap. And you better check and make sure you got what's worth what your money was in when you brought. So, I mean, I've been to a Craigslist meetup a number of times for um, for items, not like services, but for items. Like I sold like a, uh, a Sirius XM radio back in the fucking day. I sold one and uh, I, we agreed it was going to be 60 bucks. We get there. Would you take 40? No, bro. I said fucking 60 bucks. How how hard is this to fucking understand? You agreed to it. We came all the way out here. I have a gun on me just in case you pull some shit. I want my 60 bucks. Okay, fine. Fuck it. And then, you know, we got fucking other people. I was sold, selling a Wii Fit fucking thing that I got from my mom. She didn't want to use it. My mom, 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 mom. I got you a damn Wii Fit. Calm down. And then, uh, you know, you don't appreciate anything. So I got her that and then she didn't want it. So I was selling it to someone and they tried to give me like 50 bucks on what I was sorry let's begin never buying shit off Facebook again real talk I'm about ready to cry my fuckers Don gave me a big flat ass board I'm thinking it's a 55 inch smart TV I should have checked first shake my head cry 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 <laughs> oh my god if that really happened I'm sorry listen it's not funny but Holy shit. You think you'd be able to tell kind of the difference, right? Man, that's smart. That's smart. All right, mortals, listen up. 
Does it truly matter who you are? Why can't mortals let others bell? Who they are? Why do mortals get so butthurt over things like my robes? Why do they get so butthurt? It's not like I'm hurting anyone. Mortals fear what they don't understand, and they are very closed-minded. United Kingdom, but if you are going to be a bitch about who others are trying to be themselves, then go fuck yourself, nah mean, so don't fear on doing you fuck what other mortals foretell you you do you for you 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 do you be you be you be 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 and that's what matters the only true person slash mortal you can truly trust is you and only you because the united kingdom what you need united kingdom what to do with yourself but if you have a biff or jiff then of course let them help you the best way they can and of course trust but other than that you can really only trust yourself to be that was, that was, I'm, thank you. As a mortal, as a mere mortal, it's nice to hear from a robe-wearing, godly, cringe type. I really appreciate that. Because I truly only trust myself. And, and, and you, you and your posts are one of the fucking reasons why I don't trust anyone else. So, thanks. Some people are really really against Trump. And I understand it. I understand it. I, I wanted to keep politics out of this episode. I swear to God. But it just gets so hot and heavy so fast. Some people, they just go a little too far with it. God. Fuck you, Trump. Your politics are so stupid that you don't get, you don't belong here. <laughs> he doesn't. Go back, or evil shit. Hope I'll die. You're so pissed that Trump's president and you don't think he belongs here that you were gonna die to show to teach him a lesson or something oh, okay i don't i don't it can be pretty scary to get drunk sometimes it really can i'll tell you that sometimes you might think some crazy shit. fan question no bashing i drunk a few drinks of a alcohol beverage and i started feeling Nuses, nauses, wait, no, nos, nauseous, I guess they mean, to my belly. Is that a sign of pregnancy? What the fuck are you talking about? What do you mean is it a sign of, have you ever, do you, okay, when you drink a lot of alcohol, you tend to get sick. Alcohol is like toxic to the body. It's like poison. You're not supposed to be taking it in large quantities. So it might make you sick. Wait till she has the hangover. She's gonna think that she's, Terminal. Terminal pregnancy. Mom! <laughs> Mommy! So the world has been pretty, pretty hateful lately. Blacks against whites, whites against blacks, Asians just watching, wondering what's going on. It's a pretty hateful world out there right now. Terrible. Wow, can't believe how offensive this video is. By saying blacks come first, Okay, you need to spell it right. Don't that no shortcuts on the word come. You're not allowed to take shortcuts on the word come. You don't take a shortcut on that one. Everyone has a black heart. What? A white people were made after um hello alarm bells by throwing in some music and some cute little kids, then it's okay to say whatever they want. But in fact, this video is all proper gander. It's not like a fake gander. This is a proper gander. She's taking a proper gander at this. All this video is suggesting is that blacks are superior. Color shouldn't even come into, oh God, stop, stop. Stop with the cum shit, please. The only thing we should be teaching our children is that no color, race, gender, or region is above any other. We are all made the same. We are all equal. We are, we all are born with red beating hearts. I thought the hearts were black. We are all the same. Listen, I agree with a lot of what you just said, but stop with the cum shit. I, it's not that, it's not that. That's it's just some things, you know, some shortcuts you don't take. Shortcut to bad places. I hate, I hate people. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's that time again. Time for another segment of Rob's Rejects. 
Our first contender gets straight to the point. If you want a man who gets straight to the point, then go go with this guy, I guess. And he says, hi, you like when I fuck my ass? When you want, you can watch and record me. I do pics too. You can upload and share them. I would love to be your public bitch. I would give you my personal informations to identify my too. You don't have to show you. Perhaps I get blackmailed, but this is the risk to be your whore. I would do it. When not, I will search for a other woman to use me. So ladies, it seems the offer is expiring rather quickly, so if you want this guy, you better jump on it and watch him fuck his own ass. Ah. Alright ladies, try to keep calm during this next one because nothing is hotter than a confident male who are capable of being the most insufferable people on the face of the planet, but okay. And he says, one of the biggest things a girl will say when she pissed at you is, yo dick small. Best believe if I show you my dick, you'll be sucking it 30 seconds later. So ladies, if you're in the mood to suck a dick in under 30 seconds, this is the guy for you. Soon as he pulls that sucker out, you'll be sucking on that sucker till sucking sucks the suck. You're gonna love it. It's probably pretty greasy and smelly though, so maybe some Listerine strips are in order. Let's go to the next contender. Ow. Our final contender believes that love applies to everyone and that no one should be exempt. That's something I think we can all get behind. Let's see what he says. He posted, we're all different on the inside. Hashtag trans age. Hashtag age fluid, hashtag LGBTQIAPKC. <clears throat> hashtag love is love. And that photo is very disturbing and fucked up. That's it for this uh, segment of Rob's Rejects. Uh, pick, Take your pick. Either you go with the guy who fucks his own ass for you, the guy whose dick you're going to suck in 30 seconds guaranteed or your money back, or you need to be like three years old. Okay. And that's it for this episode of Why Would You Put That on the Internet? Remember, if you see something ridiculous on the internet, be sure to screen cap and send it to me either through my Facebook fan page or my Twitter, which are both linked in the description below. And don't, don't have sex with kids. You're not a, no trans age. That shit is bullshit. Thank you for this public nervous announcement. All right, guys, thanks again for watching. Please be sure to hit this video with a like. It means the world to me. Seriously, seriously, I fucking need it. Check out another video of mine over here. Press up here to subscribe. Fuck.